These are Black and Decker Dustbuster Vacuum Cleaner. These two models are most popular handheld vacuum cleaner and they are both cordless. I'll be using these two vacuum cleaner for a few months now. And in this video, I'm going to share with you some of my experience, some of my thoughts. So if you want to buy one, which one you should buy or you just need two. So let's get started. Let's talk about the small one. The small one is very light. It is only 1.4 pounds and you see the handle while you're using it, using the handle is you don't feel tired and the angle is pretty much like naturally 45 degrees. So basically when you push, it just starts. For the bigger one, there's a switch, you switch on. So here, are a little bit difference. The small vacuum cleaner, the dust bowl size is 0.33 liter, and the bigger one is 0.61 liter, almost two times the size of the small one. But in my opinion, uh, the dust bowl size it does not matter that much because when you're using it, it won't like collecting a lot of dust because basically uh, what I'm using it is for small area, especially on the table. Uh, for example, your working table or just around the computer or around the dining table. Mostly I use this for dust, for any area hard to clean. Here is an arrow, so you can like put this one a little bit further. That's pretty much what it can reach. So, if you are planning to use it all around the house, for example, you want to clean underneath the sofa, probably the bigger one is better because it got more uh, powerful suction. Also, it got the longer reach. You see here, while you're holding it, they're almost the same length, but it can pull even further like this. So when you're going to reach some area that usually you have to move the furniture away, so using this one, you can reach it. For another thing is that if the space is very narrow, so if this doesn't work, you can also rotate like this. Rotate to any angle that they want. It's super convenient. And both of them come with the little brush. So for this one, you just flip and you can start. And for the small one, actually this is a attachment. Usually you don't really need this. So for the empty and the cleaning, they're almost the same. Here you can see the motor and here you can clean the filter very easily. And the bigger one, the same. You push easily, you can take the part and uh, both of them, the filter can be washed and also uh, the dust bowl can be washed as well. Both of them come with the charger. For the small one, the charger can be mounted onto the wall. So I put it onto the wall. It's very convenient. For the bigger one, the charger, it is the plate like this. So you just uh, put this one now like this. For me, I bought two because I want one of the little ones can be using not on the ground. So basically on the table is a little bit more cleaner. For anywhere around the house, it's harder to clean, like on, underneath the furniture and between the furniture, somewhere like inside the cabinets, inside the closet, I use it a lot. It works very well. So in my opinion, they are both very good and very convenient vacuum cleaner. From my experience, I think they are very easy to use. You don't need to looking for a power cord. You just grab it and start working. 
I think like 10 seconds or even 15 seconds, the small area is done. And then you just put it back. And next time when using it, it's ready because most of the time it's on the charger. It got safety features that it won't overcharge. So the battery can last longer. And I think it's up to you because if you want more longer uh, duration and you want more power and long, the longer reach, I think this bigger one is your choice, best choice. So if you just want a, a very tiny, very easy handheld vacuum cleaner and you don't need to reach that far, I think this one is better. It's lighter and cheaper, almost have the same power of the suction. It works very well to pick up even the nail screws. All right, I hope this video is helpful. Thank you for watching.